Mm. Mm. Yeah. Milk tea. Good boba. Hey everyone. John Chow here from johnchow.com. And this is the President's Day edition of the dot com lunch. Happy President's Day. And uh, I just got, I just came here from Cause and Coffee. I mean, if you haven't seen a video, my Cause and Coffee video, do check it out. It was a lot. It was got by far the biggest cars I've ever seen. Like the lineup was a half a mile long to get into the parking lot. It's insane. Wow. I mean, it went all the way outside into the main street and the police had to shut down the gate. Because it's President's Day. I don't know, that's, that's the reason. But it, it was insane. That's but do, do, do check it out if you haven't seen the video. I actually took a walk from the show onto the street and you can see all the cars just lining up trying to get in. It, <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah. So, uh, you know, President's Day. It's supposed to be the day for our President of the United States, but I, isn't it originally made? It's supposed to be George Washington's birthday, right? I don't know. I, I think don't that's know what, what I think the President's Day, is like, you know, yeah, we have lots of presidents, but I think President's Day is specifically done during George Washington's birthday, our first President of the United States. So I, I'm not sure. I'll look it up to be absolutely sure, but uh, I think that's what it is. But anyway, happy, happy President's Day. Happy President's Day. Make sure you go get out and get yourself a mattress. That's right. That's right. First day of mattress sale. Always on and couches. couches and uh, sofas and uh, bleachers and whatever else. <laughs> whatever else. Sofa. You see what Elon Musk did recently? Like he, he, he they announced that because they're going to raise another two billion dollars of of money by selling more shares. Okay. Now, just two weeks ago during the earnings call, he said that someone, so an analyst asked him about, do, does, do you think capital, Tesla needs another capital raise? You know, how's your cash position? And he says two weeks ago, he go, nah, we don't need to raise any money. Not, not at all. He go, we don't see, we're spending money as fast as we can. We have a $4 billion cushion. I don't see a need to raise money. It makes no sense at the moment. It makes no, absolutely no sense. Mm. But of course, at that time, Tesla's stock was about 500 bucks. Now that the stock's at $780, he go, we're gonna raise some money. <laughs> we're gonna raise two billion bucks. We're gonna raise some money. <laughs> Yeah, of course, you know, you take pretty, advantage you know, of it. Your stock goes yeah. up, you can take advantage of it. I mean, it, it, it's a smart move. It's a smart move. Mm -hmm. Now, you can extra two billion bucks go in, you show up your financial statement, your balance sheet looking good. Now you can really, you don't have to worry about, you know, getting to a cash crunch again. Bumps. Yeah. This parking lot in this mall, what's this mall called? Walnut Village? Walnut Village? No, I forgot. Well, whatever, whatever. But the parking lot, we might be so much of a fan cubic. All the spaces are so tight. You know, like you go, we, go, we go to the Irvine Spectrum Center and the spaces are made for like yeah. kind of like escalates, right? Yeah. They're so wide right. and everything. You can, you, you can put two smarts in the same spot. Right. Here, you can only put one smart. Yeah. Can you put one small, small <laughs> It'll be one tight. Smart. I mean, but my Tesla, when I pack in it, I mean, I got so little space between the car next to me. And nobody here cares. Nobody cares. Uh, it's, uh, but I don't know why. I don't know why. This, this place is due for a, re a renovation. Yeah. Hey, Oscar's here. Look at that, everyone. Well, anyway, we, we have our core group here, and we got the Lao table over there. That's what the Lao the table. Same table or just the Lao table? <laughs> yeah. That's right. The last time they were here, they were loud, but not this time. See, they're being quiet. Cause, you know why? Because I'm going to aim the camera at them. See, so they know. They know. All right, so I tried something different today. I did not go for pho. i going for pepper calamari. And, uh, and a bomb in. So this is the calamari. It looks, yeah, I, I see the pepper and I see scallions and I see a cool looking dip. And that is not guacamole, okay? It's not, that's not guacamole. <laughs> it is not guacamole. It's not? But yeah. First time I ordered that, I thought, and I literally took yeah, a Well, anyway, let me give it a try and see how it is. All so right, let's try this guacamole. Oh, by the way, if this video looks really, really good, it's because I'm using my Sony again. I finally got my Sony back, so this is the A7. That's why the quality is so much better than a Canon. Yeah. Anyway, so let, let's try it. Let's dip it. This is not guacamole. This is both, Oscar thinks this is spicy, but we'll see. I didn't. I just had the soup noodle bar. That is so good. A calamari is so soft. This spice, this sauce just gets up a notch. Really it's good. Not, it's not spicy, but the problem is yeah. when I first had it, I took a spoonful of it. It's good. It's good. I need a chopstick. Yeah. Damn. There you go. But that, that's really good. That's really good. And I, I, I guess the scallion is really more for show than for taste. I wouldn't really eat well, it. Eat it. I would eat it. I love those things. I think it's good too, yeah. 
Yeah. Even the veggies good. I want to ask you guys about something. Mm. Let's turn this ah. with that. Sure but the main thing is, this calamari is among the most tender calamari I've ever tasted. All right. Mm. Wow. Does the calamari stand on its own without the sauce? Yes. It does. Try one. Yeah, that's all. Wait, I got some food. I'll try mm. one. That's yeah, right. It's good. I'm good, huh? It's really good. That's really good. Yeah. Sean, give it a try. You gotta give it a no, try. I'm gonna try it. So I'm gonna save my room here. Yeah. Right. Mm. So here. So tender. Yeah, really tender. Whoa! Check out the dish. What is this? It's pineapple fried rice. Pineapple fried rice. Um. Yeah. That, that's awesome. Look at that. Look at it. It's basically pineapple rice and using half a whole pineapple. Yeah. Yeah, it's like Thai fried rice. It's nice. Really? I don't have I see peanuts. I see shredded pork. <laughs> Look at that. There you go. Look at that. He has a good view of it. Yeah, you got Instagram that out. That, that's awesome. For those who don't know, that is an oxtail. Yes, that is an oxtail soup. I mean, you're eating the tail of an ox, you realize that. I mean, I mean, I guess you want some tail. And, and again, I have to remind you, I am Puerto Rican. So That's right, you want tail. I want tail. <laughs> so this is my ba min, which is a Vietnamese sub. And it's like a normal sub, except that, you know, it's, it's kind of like pho in a sub. It's really because if you look at it, you look at the stuff inside, you see the pickle, you see pepper, you see uh, the radishes, and you see the chicken. So this is the chicken in there. Yeah. So. Yeah, let's give this a try and see how I like it. Affiliate. Yeah. Look at that. I refer to chicken. I just told my buddies, hey, go use it. All right, so let me squeeze everything together. The six hundred dollar deal. Mm. It's 30-some percent. It's like 33% or something. So I'm like, mm. I get this notification and I'm like, what? And then look. That's good. Like, what? <laughs> 400 bucks. For it. Mm. Yeah, I sold two. Next time or I'm going to try the pork. I want to try them all. The chicken is very good. Oscar liked the calamari so much, he ordered one himself. And I noticed that you get a lemon. Oh, yeah, my one didn't come with a lemon. You, you know, how come your one got a lemon? Yep, thank you. Not only did you get a lemon, you also got lemon. You also got some salt and pepper too. Yeah. Cool. I, I feel cheated now. <laughs> and you got a bomb in as well, but your one is pork, right? Yeah. Pork bomb in. Yeah. Next time I'll try that. Oh, all right. So that was another good lunch. Only 20 bucks too, which is really not that bad, considering, you know, I had a drink and a milk, I had a drink and a, and a sandwich and the, the dessert was the most, I mean, the appetizer was the most expensive, $8 for the calamari, but it was really, really good. Uh, anyway, like I said, we do this most Saturday, not next Saturday, because coming up is ski weekend. I'm going to Mammoth. Mammoth, yeah, because uh, President's Day, normally most schools only get the long weekend. They only get Monday off, but Sally School, they decided to take the whole week off. They call it Ski, ski Weekend. So apparently myself, Sally, and a bunch of her friends, we're going to Mammoth to ski for the whole week. So watch uh, this channel to see my trip to Mammoth. All right. And uh, so when I get back here, we'll do .com lunch again. And if you're in the Orange County area, come join us. We'd love to have you.